All right, in many national polls, Mississippi still remains near the bottom of the health scale, but the Telenutrition Center at USM aims to change that by educating local communities. Jacqueline Coleman has this week's Kindness in Action. Kindness in Action is brought to you by Forest General Hospital. Behind these walls of Southern Hall lies the Telenutrition Center, which aims to find solutions specific to Mississippi health disparity. Our overall mission is actually to get Mississippians to move more, eat better, to live healthier lives. And by doing that, director of the center, Dr. Jennifer Lamax, works with her students on health disparity research and sends them out in the community to educate others on how to live healthy lives. We have students who work as staff for us on our research projects. We also have a um, outreach scholars program where they come and they work about 20 hours a week for us. Currently, Mississippi ranks near the bottom of national health. Through statistical data and focus groups, Lamax works to educate minority communities on the importance of taking care of your body. Go out and they have various types of common drinks. They might have a bottle of Coke, a bottle of Gatorade, and so forth. And then they have visuals to show how much sugar is in them. And then what they try to do is give samples of healthier alternatives that have lesser sugars to the communities. The center also partners with My Brother's Keeper in reaching and serving the community throughout health disparity research. We are actually conducting a research project um, with that center in the outpatient setting to figure out how to offer nutrition and physical activity counseling in that outpatient setting. In the end, for Lamax, it's all about spreading the message and engaging communities on living longer, healthier lives. As a dietitian and a health and health disparities researcher, it's always been my drive to make sure that my neighbor is living the healthiest life possible because I believe that our neighbor's health impacts our own health. If you know, he or she's not doing well, I'm not doing well either. Jacqueline Coleman, Fox 23 News. If you want to nominate someone for kindness in action, go to forestgeneral.com slash kindness in action.